Welcome back to Europa Universalis. My name is Venturius, and welcome back to Ireland. We've lost our good buddy, France, because of a little bit of dispute about some land. Let me show you guys. They kind of want to have, well, a lot of our, our land. New Ireland over here. And a lot of creek land. Well, like I said, they want a lot of land, and that's kind of problem. Kind of want to rule the world. They want to be. Well, they want to be something big. So we lost our alliance, and I'm kind of preparing for war with England. Just because, well, it's it's not safe. I need to get this area quick. I don't mind being at war with France for that land. I don't even mind if they get it. But at the moment, I am trying to become friends with Spain. And we'll have to wait three more years before we can attack England again. In the meantime, we will take Maine. And well, the creek has become pretty strong, so I don't think we need to worry about New Ireland or any other big areas. We do have another trade merchant, so we should do something about that one. And well, I wonder what we are going to do. We got already got one there, we got one there. Yeah, we could do that one, but I don't know if it's going to help us anything. And we got that one. So we kind of need to go do some fun stuff on mainland. We don't want to be in any trouble with Ireland. They're integrating Sweden, so they are going to be pretty big. They like. Austria and Pomerania so those are two countries we need to be clear of and so let us unpause the game let's see if we can make some money and let's rush to 1616 so we can attack England no we are first going to attack Maine Maine is man who have did you get in war with this guy? Did you colonize? I guess you did. England. Wait a second. Did you colonize? How did... Where is man England? Oh, wait a second. Are you a vassal or something like that? As the following colonies, England, yeah, man has become, uh, it's become England. So we cannot take man. Oh man, that was bugger. We still have some religion turmoil, so we might be able to. Ooh, the Pope is in war with some rebels. That's fun. We might be able to Empire of China. I don't care about that one. I want to be the Holy Roman Empire. I don't mind that one either. This one. So we are at Crusade at Tunis and Lithuanian is the pop controller. All right, we invested, so we'll get a little bit of influence along the way. Yeah, that was to be expected. And we've got another area colonized slowly, slowly. I kind of want to see if we have to do anything with the fleet. I don't think so. Dutch? What's this? Dutch new... It's Holland. Holland has taken over. Oh, 
Maybe it wasn't Scotland. I thought it was Scotland, but I don't think they, it is. So you're Brittany. I don't like Brittany being here, but oh well, there's nothing I can do about it at the moment. Yes, we could do something about it, but we're not going to do something about it. That's just the way it has to go. We are just going to rush to 16. Let's take a look at our technology and because we are all going for the lucky iron achievement. We're a little bit behind in tech on these two. And do I need a, no, I don't need a military engineer. We could use some advisors, national unrests, productivity, that one is kind of expensive. I'm not that rich, diplomatic relationships, trade efficiencies, no, no good one. All right, so who are the big boys? The Ottomans, Spain, Russians, Portugal, how can Portugal be? All right. You guys are still drilling. We got some ships going on in this area. Well, we could do a little war over here, but well, I don't want to make waste manpower. We could uh, bring our army, make it a little bit stronger. Let's see, we first need a good leader. Well, it's only level one. Oh, all right. I don't mind. I don't mind. 14, so 15. We are close in being able to declare war. And I believe England will have his whole damn army on the other side of the ocean. And that will be fun. Because, well, England is quite big British Mexico. But, well, they are not strong enough to face the Aztecs yet. Kind of funny how they also have... Ooh, it's a Dutch. Alright, we've lost... What people? Black news. Confidence in the government leading drop in stability. That's not a good thing. That's definitely not a good thing. Well, we're still making a lot of money. So how many troops can we have? We can have over 70. We are far from that. And with two more cannons, uh, one more infantry, and one more cavalry. That way we get like a two regular good armies. Building up our army strength is a good thing. Especially if we want to take London fast and quickly. And I might... I might want to have like a small army ready. Can I even build troops in this area? Oh, yes, we can. All right. Let's build like one troop and then make an army of six. So a lot of troops are being built at the moment. We are almost in 16. We paid a loan. We called the diplomat. Can we know that was in like 20? I still have no idea where to put my... Where to put the merchants. Could do this one transfer steer transfer the trade power. Alright, now let's see. 
Got like one troop. Let's make it just a six if I can make that. I don't think so. But well, let's start a war. Declare war. First expansion. No, I guess it's still not over yet. Let me see. Let me check. In June, all right. I don't mind, I don't mind. I can wait just a few more months. In the meantime, we are getting like still a lot of money. Make one more. Our truce with the British has expired, all right. Let's have some fun. We need a new general. Maybe I should have been drilling. Because now I'm kind of getting crappy generals. Hmm. Alright, well. I don't mind. Declare war. We are going to take Derby. I first want to see if there's any troops down here. I don't think so. No, I definitely don't think so. So we are going to carpet sheet select a unit that's going that way. You guys that way I guess you are immediately going to London Ooh, there's another fort over there all right this is all they can blockade whatever they want now let's take a look at our So we get some iron keys coming up that way. So I definitely need to get like... Where is this army leader? Hmm. Got some more troops over there because I kind of want to take this as well. Just to have a little fun there. Recruitment is out of the necessary. I definitely don't want to lose that one. Let's gain a little bit. Yeah, we could definitely do that. Alright, you go that way. Guys, go and take that one as well. So we got that land under control. You can't take that one, that's you're going to corner this area that way I don't get any troops being built and as soon as we've taken that there's really nothing you guys can do about that as well now we get a civil war in Flandern all right well that's fun for them I don't really mind ok 
kind of hard to see Denmark still struggling with those religions people. on this side then let's see where are we going I guess we are going south now it's just a matter of time waiting for us to take London that's a level 3 fort so it will take a little bit of time but I wonder how much land can we take from them can we take it all Kind of funny, I kind of wanted to take man as well, but <laughs> I think I might be releasing it. Something like that. No, we are not going to do that that way. Can we, is there any land we can take? That land we've already taken. No, nope. we need to go south that way. Alright, I don't mind, but for now the focus is totally on the British Isle because that's what we need for the achievement. Come on. If only I had like some big ships because this is a navy. This is a transport navy. I wonder. I wonder. Can we? These two four provinces should be able to build. The navy is too small. We need to have at least 1500 sailors, and we don't have. Yeah, we do have that. How can there be, oh, I guess we need to build some galleons first. Oh, those are expensive. I guess I do want to have some galleons. Do they have like, no, they don't. All right, this is a good thing, getting technology up a bit. And I guess we can do like, an offensive idea yeah that would be good because we are way ahead of time and this will give us a moral speed bonus all right so we've got a lot Alright, so the Iron Keys want to peace out. What happened over there? Because... Did we take their land? Yes, we did. So we could make that part of New Ireland. Occupied by New Ireland, occupied by New Ireland. Yes, we are definitely going to... Make them become part of... I cannot. You cannot make that my core. Oh man. Hmm. Well, we could make them give all our, the money. I don't really mind. We can take that in a later separate war. And then with that money, we can buy like a few more ships. Because I really want to try and go and fight them on their own terms. Like, the biggest navy they got is transport ships, and I kind of want to have main as well. Alright, so we got our main. 
we get the mainland, but that will not be enough. So I guess we are going to. What kind of leader do we have? Yes, we're going to just ask for access. Military access. Hmm. Alright, that's not fun. Can we, like, move to... We have to move, like, all the way around it. Well, we are first going to go to that one. The other one. So you are the crappy one, so you can go away. All right. Well, we're seventy-one. We definitely need more. And that's why I want to build those ships to get some more. I can build like four of those big ships. We can take on, like, the transport fleet. Alright, another one. We're still not getting close to tacking up, but... To be close to the other guys. Alright, so they did get access somehow. Alright, well, that's good, that's good. I hate those things. I, I never get why you get like this sign. It's like an omen. Oh, they will lose their fighting strength pretty fast once we've taken the British Mexico. Uh, we will be taken. Once we rule England, pity is they do have a good general on that, so. Recruitment time minus 10, that's never a bad thing. And now I'm building the last ship we did. It's going to take us some time, but I want to become a little bit stronger on the seas. That way we can patrol those areas as well so after these I'm going to build like 10 light ships All right I just saw an English where's my my force they over there so we didn't discover it like that that's kind of pity Alright, let's settle this one then. I guess that's the next one on the list. Alright, so we have a little rebel problem. At least we won. So if we have the rebel problem, I am going to send my troops back to their main section, the main army regiment, yeah this one will we're at 80% I definitely want one of it and we're slowly taking the British English
They didn't just think we should. We would have arrived all the way over here. Fun thing is we already took the other area as well. They got a lot of rebels. Alright, uh, we are in the minus. That's not good. Minus eight. Oh, I guess that's because... I'll just lose the 50 jackets, we'll fix that later. Damn, they have like a lot of... I wonder, what are you guys going to give me? Are you giving me like London as well? Are you going to seed Hull to Ireland? Well, that's a pretty good start, but I kind of want a little bit more. I want London. I want the city of London. And then I guess, let's see, how much can we take? Good military coalition, Great Britain, I don't care. Oh man, this is already my max. I want to take Hull as well, because that's going to be a pain in the ass. Well, I guess this is going to be it. This is 100%. Oh my god. <sighs> this is one pain in the ass. Alright, you guys are going to do a lot of... Rebel suppression and you as well. Oh my god. So we finally managed to get ourselves like a fleet. We're losing a lot of money. It's all because of army maintenance. I guess that's because you. Yeah, we're, we're still. What? Why did that build a brick? It's like a transport. Hmm. That wasn't meant to be. So this unit, and I guess you guys are going to. Hunt for pirates. In the Northern Sea. Yes, that would be good. Because now we have like London and well. I would almost say we should collect trade. So you are going to. Now we are collecting. You are going to be redrawn. Because I want to collect. Collect. And that's this guy, I think. Yes, it is. Nope, that's the wrong one. Damn it. Right, so we got some rebellions going on. Now I need to get my troops all the way back. Oh my god. Totally forgot about that. Uh, let's get the troops back to that area. And... Oh man, we made a little bit of mess for our land. And the first thing that we are going to do to fix this little mess is to get rid of that damn fortress. How much is that going to save us? I, I only took like a one province with one fortress. And we're going to make cores. I totally forgot about that as well. Alright, Brandenburg has become the supreme we need to cover London as fast as possible. 
I need to fix my army problem. How can the colony maintenance be that high? Root out corruption, that will go in time. Alright, for now we need to save us a little bit of money. So to do that, I'm going to recall him. That's going to save us money. And we need to wait until our... We got a true from Brittany, English separatists die. Those are really going to be a pain in the ass. Where is our army now? Is it moving back already? Yes, no. Alright, so it is moving back. Alright, we've got like 40,000. Oh my god. 40,000 troops. How the hell did they manage to get like 40,000 troops rebellion? Alright, but well, we fixed it. This is going to cost us another loan, but as soon as we get like the rebellion done, I must say it did secure our eight spot. We still got some rebels. I really don't need to man rebels. Look at their fleet. They have been. Their fleet has been. Whoa, what has happened here? Total rebellion. Alright, well, I hope you guys all enjoyed this episode because we have gotten a little bit closer to the lucky iron achievement. I can almost smell it. Well, only France can spoil it, kind of. And other things like EU4 always tries to kick you in the butt. But for now, we are going to try and stabilize the land and hope to see you guys at the next episode. Well, I'm doing that. See you in the next video.